child marriage will be practiced principally in a Muslim and indigenous communities. But it also occurs in Christian societies, so much so that this would be a nationwide problem which should be resolved because it has deleterious effects to the children who are prematurely married or forced into marriage or are subject to child trafficking. Kung papasa ang prohibition of child marriage law, it will create a momentum sa loob ng mismong bahay. Inside the family, it will create change on how parents look at their children, on how children should assert their rights in the home. It will create change in the community and in the larger society. There are general types of offenses or crimes punishable under the proposed law. One is the facilitation of child marriage. Two is the celebration of uh, child marriage. It is beyond the project of creating spaces. We just start a movement that is so correct, that is so powerful, that uh, possesses great narratives of humanity looking sa panahon na lalaya itong mga bata rito. You cannot arrest that moment. Magstay ang girl defenders and it will fight future battles for young women and girls. At sana magtuloy-tuloy na we can broaden our influence to prepare for future battles.